Hello, this is Ray Main here again with today's Bible reading. Today we're going to be reading in the book of Numbers, chapter 3. These also are the generations of Aaron and Moses in the day that the Lord spake with Moses in Mount Sinai. And these are the names of the sons of Aaron, Nadab the firstborn, and Abihu, Eleazar, and Ithamar. These are the names of the sons of Aaron, the priests which were anointed, whom he consecrated to minister in the priest's office. And Nadab and Abihu died before the Lord when they offered strange fire before the Lord in the wilderness of Sinai, and they had no children. And let me stop right here just a minute. Offered strange fire. You know, this is mentioned two or three times in the Bible. Uh, this is my interpretation of this. You don't have to listen to it, but it it's uh, or believe it. But I haven't found anything else that fit. Nadab and Abihu they they offered strange fire. They they knew they were the the elder sons of Aaron. They had heard Moses tell Aaron what God had told them about told him about uh, how he wanted things to take place and they got a better idea one or the other of them said hey I got an idea let's do it this way so they changed up the schedule if you will I don't know exactly how you'd say that but whenever they went to officiate they did something different and they offered up strange fire and the Lord slew them for it. We've got to approach this with proper respect, folks. Although we don't have that tabernacle worship like that anymore, we still need to approach him with respect. Aren't you glad we're living in the age of grace? Anyway, And Nadab and Abihu died before the Lord when they had offered strange fire before the Lord in the wilderness of Sinai. And they had no children. And Eleazar and Ithamar ministered in the priest's office in the sight of Aaron their father. And the Lord spake unto Moses, saying, Bring the tribe of Levi near and present them before Aaron the priest that they may minister unto him. And they shall keep his charge and the charge of the whole congregation before the tabernacle of the congregation to do the service of the tabernacle. And they shall keep all the instruments of the tabernacle of the congregation and the charge of the children of Israel to do the service of the tabernacle. And thou shalt give the Levites unto Aaron and to his sons. They are wholly given unto him out of the children of Israel. And thou shalt appoint Aaron and his sons, and they shall wait on their priest's office. And the stranger that cometh nigh shall be put to death. And the Lord spake unto Moses, saying, And I, behold, I have taken the Levites from among the children of Israel, instead of all the firstborn that opened the matrix among the children of Israel. Therefore the Levites shall be mine, because all the firstborn are mine. For on the day that I smote all the firstborn in the land of Egypt, I hallowed unto me all the firstborn in Israel, both man and beast. Mine shall they be. I am the Lord. And the Lord spake unto Moses in the wilderness of Sinai, saying, Number the children of Israel, excuse me, number the children of Levi after the house of their fathers by their families. Every male from a month old and upward shall thou number them. And Moses numbered them according to the word of the Lord, as he was commanded. And these were the sons of Levi by their names, Gershon and Kohath and Merari. And these are the names of Gershon by their families, Libni and Shimei. And the sons of Kohath by their families, Amram and Ishar, Hebron and Uzael. And the sons of Merari by their families, Mali and Mushi. These are the families of the Levites according to the house of their fathers. Of Gershon was the family of the Libnites and the family of the Shemites. These are the families of the Gershonites. Those that were numbered of them according to the number of all the males from a month old and upward, 
even those that were numbered to them were seven thousand and five hundred. The families of the Gershonites shall pitch behind the tabernacle westward, and the chief of the house of the father of the Gershonites shall be Elisaph, the son of Lael. And the charge of the sons of Gershon in the tabernacle of the congregation shall be the tabernacle and the tent, the covering thereof, and the hanging for the door of the tabernacle of the congregation, and the hangings of the court, and the curtain for the door of the court, which is by the tabernacle, and by the altar round about, and the cords of it for all the service thereof. And of Kohath was the family of the Amramites, and the family of the Isharites, and the family of the Hebronites, and the family of the Uzielites. These are the families of the Kohathites. And the number of all the males from a month old and upward were eight thousand and six hundred, keeping the charge of the sanctuary. The families of the son of Holcat, Kohath shall pitch on the side of the tabernacle southward. And the chief of the house of the father of the families of the Kohathites shall be Elisaphan, the son of Uzael. And their charge shall be the ark, and the table, and the candlestick, and the altars, and the vessels of the sanctuary wherewith they minister, and the hanging, and all the services thereof. And Eleazar the son of Aaron the priest shall be chief over the chief of the Levites, and have the oversight of them that keep the charge of the sanctuary. Of Merari was the family of the Melites, and the family of the Mushites. These are the families of Merari. And those that were numbered of them, according to the number of all the males from a month old and upward, were six thousand and two hundred. And the chief of the house of the father of the families of Merari was Zerael, the son of Ab Abihel. These shall pitch on the side of the tabernacle northward. And under the custody and charge of the sons of Merari shall be the boards of the tabernacle, and the bars thereof, and the pillars thereof, and the sockets thereof, and all the vessels thereof and all that serveth thereto. <coughs> Excuse me. And the pillars of the court round about, and their sockets, and their pens, and their cords. But those that encamp before the tabernacle toward the east, even before the tabernacle of the congregation eastward, shall be Moses and Aaron and his sons, keeping the charge of the sanctuary for the charge of the children of Israel, and the stranger that cometh nigh shall be put to death. All that were numbered of the Levites, which Moses and Aaron numbered at the commandment of the Lord, throughout their families, all the males from a month old and upward, were twenty and two thousand. And the Lord said unto Moses, Number all the firstborn of the males of the children of Israel from a month old and upward, and take the number of their names. And thou shalt take the Levites for me, I am the Lord, instead of all the firstborn among the children of Israel, and the cattle of the Levites instead of all the firstlings among the cattle of the children of Israel. And Moses numbered, as the Lord commanded him, all the firstborn among the children of Israel. And all the firstborn males, by the number of names, from a month old and upward, of those that were numbered to them, were twenty and two thousand two hundred and threescore and thirteen. And the Lord spake unto Moses, saying, Take the Levites instead of all the firstborn among the children of Israel, and the cattle of the Levites instead of their cattle. And the Levites shall be mine, I am the Lord. And for those that are, re are to be redeemed of the two hundred and threescore and thirteen of the firstborn of the children of Israel, which are more than the Levites, thou shalt even take five shekels apiece by the pole after the shekel of the sanctuary thou shalt take them. The shekel is twenty gerahs. And thou shalt give the money wherewith the odd number of them is to be redeemed unto Aaron and to his sons. And Moses took the redemption money of them that were over and above them that were redeemed by the Levites. Of the firstborn of the children of Israel took he the money, a thousand three hundred three score and five shekels after the shekel of the sanctuary. And Moses gave the money of them that were redeemed unto Aaron and to his sons, according to the word of the Lord, as the Lord commanded Moses. Well, once again, I apologize for my pronunciation of these names. I had a thought while I was reading that. How many of you are guilty, as I have been, of just skimming the names whenever you read the Bible? Of just, you know, just, just running over them? 
not trying to pronounce them so well that don't make any difference anyway while I'm not going to even try to uh, I'm not knowledgeable enough I don't I don't have that uh, well I guess knowledge is as good a word as any of the meaning of the names and, and being able to connect those it's in the Bible you know that makes it important by itself I don't think there's a single word in the Bible that isn't important in some way so that's the reason why I mean if you've ever asked you well why in the world are you going through these books why are you reading these names that's the reason why there's not anything in here that's not without significance some way and really all I've been commanded to do or you know I feel compelled to do is read uh, this whole Bible eventually we'll, we'll get through the whole thing we've already done the New Testament we're well into the Old Testament um, and every scripture every word is important so I'm going to give it my best shot and uh, we'll trust that the Lord will help us with it uh, from time to time I've already had some uh, revelation seen some things that that I haven't seen before uh, and whenever I say that I just I mean by that that uh, I've seen with my eyes but all of a sudden something's opened up and from time to time I'll say something about that but anyway that kind of explains a little bit of, of why I'm, I'm doing this I felt compelled to do it said so, well I had somebody ask me one time said well do you think anybody's watching these videos I don't know I honestly don't know but you know what that's not up to me I wouldn't I wouldn't told to uh, number the people that are watching these videos and, and reading the Bible along with us I was told to do this so this is what I'm trying to do anyway that's enough of that God bless you have a blessed day